Conjure, a fantastic reception out there. How was that? Yeah, it's brilliant. You know, the fans, obviously, it's much more for them now. You know, they were really enjoying it. Obviously, we've, we've done our job and, you know, we're glad we can uh, enjoy it with them, really. You know, the fans have turned out brilliantly tonight and uh, it, it was brilliant. You know, obviously, the, the reception for me was magnificent. And, all the boys, I thought the fans were just great out there today. You're a firm fans' favourite. You may have only been with the, the club a short, relative amount of time, but you just come, they've taken you to, the, to their hearts. Yeah, of course. You know, when I came here the first time, it was one of the major factors for me coming back the second time was because I, I thought I could have a good impact on the club and, and obviously get to the goal they want. And obviously we've done that, but the fans, the way they took to me before, and where I was sort of a fans' favourite, and they, they really liked what I did and what I brought to the club and you know as a, as a player you want that and I think it makes it easier to come back in and know that you've got that little bit of respite with the fans uh, for someone like me who is, who is a goal scorer and, and probably more of a confidence player than, than obviously most players because you have to exude that confidence as a goal scorer you know the fans are always on your back uh, right behind you then it, it's, it's magnificent and it's, it's just a great feeling to have as a striker. And scoring that, that third on Sunday how, how does that as a feeling? Yeah, it's brilliant. You know, I've hit the bar a couple of times. Um, obviously, one at Oldham, one at Bury. Um, we could have, obviously, if they go in, it could have been the job done a little bit sooner. But, you know, I think um, when you score goals in any game, it's magnificent. But when you score goals in a, in a game like that, and it, it, the magnitude is it's great. It's what I came for. It's, it's these sort of moments and memories. You've had promotions before. I mean, how does this rank in your career? Yeah, of course. I've, I've got promoted to Reading before. This is, this is obviously up there as one of the best achievements I've had as a footballer. I've had about 18 months where I've not really played as much as I'd liked and I've come here, played, scored goals and, and done what I said I was going to come and do and, and obviously try and get Bolton back up on the up curve which was just helping now what we're on. How difficult was it in January to try and kind of get that move that you really wanted because you you were saying that you know Bolton's the place you wanted to come to? Yeah it was, it was a, a lot of hard work from me and I think the club as well to, to arrange that obviously they've had their own problems all season financially. Um, for me as well, it meant me giving up money to join the club. But it, it, I, I spoke down with my wife, and at the end of the day, it was about my happiness and me getting back on the pitch. No one's, no one's going to sign a striker who doesn't play and doesn't score. And I think me coming here was justified my decision. Um, for, for obviously the memories I've made here, obviously the fans' reaction to how they, I think the gaffer that has played me, and showed ultimate confidence in playing me. And I, I think about 15 matches on the spin now, so. You know, I think it's worked out really well for me and I'm really happy with my contribution here. Tell us the truth, how, when did the hangover wear off on Monday? Or it's it continue into <laughs> no, well, I've got three kids so it don't continue <laughs> mate. Life starts again when you get back home in the morning. I was back home at nine o'clock with the girls and uh, reality hit me straight in the face when obviously you're doing stuff with the kids and they don't want you lying about on the sofa feeling your head and you just got to get on with it. But it was a great night, Sunday night, and I'm glad I get to experience with all the boys and, and, the, and the management and the staff and the fans and the sponsors because, you know, that's, that's what we want, everyone has won. Do you want to stay here? I mean, are you out of contract now at Cardiff? Is it, is it, yeah, is it I'm out of contract there. Obviously, I don't know what's going to happen with me. Uh, I'm sure we'll sit down, with, obviously the gaffer will probably sit down and speak to the chairman or whatever. And if he wants to keep me, then it's, up, it's obviously up to them to, to put in the offer to my agent, etc. So it's actually a talk to go on there. But, I've always said I'm, I'm, I'm open to staying here because you know how well I've done here and, and I obviously think I can improve myself as well. You never stop improving as a footballer and I think I can really impact the season, the season in the Championship giving games because obviously I score goals. Good luck. Thanks very much. Cheers.